Hey guys, uh, sorry if you can't see me real good. I'm in, I'm in the dark here, and our overhead our overhead lights um, messed up. But I need to make a video real quick because it's important, as you'll see the title. Um, nothing's wrong as far as I know right now, of course, or anything like that. I, I'm gonna go do some blood work um, after New Year's, um, just kind of make sure I'm okay. But if you watch my past videos. Pardon me, I'm I'm clogged. I wouldn't even be making this video, but it's it's really important. Um, you probably notice if you watch my old videos on my other channel. For those of you that know, I've gained a lot of weight. Um, you know, because I can't exercise, can't do anything because of this withdrawal. Things are better. I'm in sort of a window now. Uh, let me move this back. Okay, or. There we go. I think you can see me better. Okay. Um, you know, the withdrawal is, of course, better. I'm coming up on two years and about two months. Uh, but I don't know how my health is, and I can't exercise. You know, you know, to get my weight off, I would have to really start exercising. I can't do that. Um, I'm going to have to start trying to eat right. And I thought about doing the green smoothies. But my teeth, it makes them hurt, um, like sensations. And um, I don't know if that's withdrawal related or if my teeth are damaged, which I think is from the benzos. I think they damaged and destroyed my teeth. I've lost quite a few teeth. I've gained a lot of weight. I've lost hair. The drug destroyed my life. I know that. <coughs> like I said, pardon my voice. Um, when I get sick, that's another thing takes me forever to get well um people could say well you know you go out well yeah you got to go out if you work you know so i'd be sick either way and of course i'm not able to work sorry about that i'm trying to get done before she gets home but guys i don't know how my health is and nobody really helps me nobody believes me my mom doesn't really believe me uh She'll bring up remarks about me being fat, like making fun or, you know, because, you know, I'm lazy, you know, quote unquote, I'm I'm lazy and I don't want to do anything. And um, she uh, doesn't understand that I can't even stand for long periods of time. Sometimes I can. But a lot of times I can't. And I just want you guys to know if anything happens to me, I'm not going to do it. I'm saying if it's beyond my control. If I die, if uh, I start getting in really bad health, because, I mean, I exercised a year and a half ago trying, and it knocked me back into this, you know. So, I mean, I don't know what to do. And uh, if anything happens, though, please remember these videos. Please download them if you can. I don't care about me, but people need to know my story, that they have destroyed my life. They've destroyed a lot of people's lives that are on YouTube, that are all over the world, that are suffering just like me. Their lives are wrecked. Uh, and uh, I asked to save my videos. Save the videos of my other channel, Family Man 20. They put a strike on my channel because of a video I uploaded eight years ago. I don't know what that's about. I'm going to try to get that fixed as soon as I get done making this video. But remember these videos. I'm going to download them and try to put them on a disc if I can get a friend to do it for me. Um, I hope YouTube will leave these up. Because my story needs to be told that no one else ever gets destroyed by this drug like these people have done. Because these people are evil, man. They don't care what they do. They don't care who they hurt. It's all money with them. You're just a, a you're just a, a I can't talk. You're just a statistic, you know, a statistic to them. They don't care. And I just need to know that I'll be remembered, guys. I'm not going anywhere on my own volition. It's going to be if something happens to me, uh, you know, health-wise, beyond my control. 
Um, because I will never quit fighting these people, ever. But I just needed it known, guys, just to do what you can in case something happens. Um, I would ask anybody to tell my story. No, I can say not for me. I don't care about me. But people need to know this. These people need to pay the price for what they've done because they knew what they did. It's all documented. Books have been written. Reporters and investigative journalists, they discovered it. They lied. They knew all along these drugs were dangerous and hid it for money so they could make money. And they should pay. I just ask guys, just remember me. Um, like I said, please download these videos if you can. Save them um, in case something happens. Because I don't know if I'll ever be able to exercise again. I, I don't know. Um, I'm obviously better. But I figure even when the symptoms stop, when the waves stop, which could be another, I mean, you know, it's that there. I still have them, so they're not gone. But when they stop, it'll probably be another year I'll have to wait to let this nervous system calm down. So I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, and that's why I ask, please save these videos. Do what you can. Um, and just don't let my, my story go in vain. Don't let me die in vain. Um, remember all the others online. They're suffering too. Don't forget about them. Um, that these people will be in hell one day that did this to us. Because they're not sorry for what they did. They would do it all over again. They are spawns of Satan. And they will get theirs one day. In this life and the life to come. That's all I got to say, guys. I just ask all y'all to, like I said, just remember me in case anything happens. Uh, if it's up to me, I'm not going anywhere. But as we know, things happen. You know, and it's not always up to us when we live, when we die sometimes. So just remember me if anything happens, guys. I'm going to go ahead and get off here, guys. Uh, like I said, just remember me. Thanks, guys.